25 years celebration of the Apostolic Church is on. And the church is celebrating 25 years after the inauguration of the first convention of the church. Right here are the pastors, superintendents that already serve under the area within 25 years. As you can see, the numbers of superintendents that led the area and currently another person is leading the area. 25 years celebration is a good one that the church cannot just play with. And that is why you see from all walks of lives, those in the government and those that are in the church gathered together to do the celebration of the church. Vice President of the Apostolic Church and the Chairman of the Lona Territory is leading the service. Luckily, he serves as opposed to within the 25 years of the church of the FCT. Others, superintendents, are in the house to do the celebration. But let me hear from him what chairman, vice president of the Apostolic Church, what is running in his mind, what he has for the church. I'm privileged to have one of the apostles that worked 25 years ago that know much about the Apostolic Church FCT, our Abuja area. And luckily, I have number one, and the Lona Territory. I'm not going to mention his name. He's going to say his name by himself. Sir, your name? I am Pastor Dr. S. G. Uye. That is Senior Gabriel Abako Uye. And um, I'm the Lona Territorial Chairman at present. Also the Vice President of the Apostolic Church Nigeria. Thank Having him uh, is a great honor. So what can you say about Abuja area currently celebrating 25 years of convention. The Lord has done us very well in Abuja. For years we have been toiling to see that the church stands and our late fathers created the place as an area 1993 and since then more progress development. In fact, Abuja has become about five, six areas now by the way of evangelization. So we are very happy. The Lord has done great things for us. Thank you. What's your message to Nigerian leaders? Leaders. I, I have said it once and I will continue to say it. It is a time of uh, by uh, restoring us to our former anthem. I am very happy with that, and I told the congregation that I was in secondary school, 1960, when we had the first, when we started it, and um, I believe I am now telling the leaders to raise up justice, righteousness, mercy, so that every one of us will enjoy. We want peace in the land. The Lord should help them. They are doing it, but we are praying more as the church so that they continue we want them to raise up righteousness and justice thank you as the chairman of uh, lona territory your message to members in the metropolitan area of abuja metro my message is for them that they keep on moving forward forward ever backward never more aggressive evangelism for progress and expansion. The Lord will empower them and use them. I, I know you have a good motive for youth in the Apostolic Church. What are some of your plans for the youth? Okay, I have very good. I have plans for the youth. The Lord has even inspired me to raise the youth. In the ministry, pastors, we want to raise them. I have raised more than 112 a few months ago. I have employed more than 100 in uh, February this year. And so I have even ordained more young people to the ministry. And I want them to move forward. The plan is that they are the, the ones that will take over from us.
Therefore, I want them to be up and doing and stand well so that they take up this mantle from us. We are getting old. Yes, sir. I watched you speaking at the UK when you went to the UK during the uh, memorabilia ceremony of uh, late Olutola. And you give you give a count of how things. What can you say about Olutola? Uh, so you 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 ha you heard from me. Yes. Well, I, the man was a man of God, very dynamic, and is the man who have done great exploits in the apostolic church. He's my personal father, as I take him, and he took me as a son. Uh, the man was focused. Very focused and dynamic and moving the world forward. He has done great, great things for us in the Apostolic Nigeria, which we cannot forget. And that's why we gave him a very good, great, befitting burial at Elisha some months ago. The last thing I want to ask at this moment is that uh, when you are out of the seat of the vice president, what will you love to be remembered for? I have started many things that I would like people to remember me for. Remembering the widows and the widowers, their welfare. I have started that. Secondly, I have uh, increased the staffing of ministers for them to be more happy to do the work. And we are other projects which we want to do if we have the money, yeah, because man proposes, God disposes. We, if we have the money, as we are praying for the restoration and uh, healing of this land, we will do many projects structurally, which we will be remembered for. Well, thank you so much. Uh, Daddy said you would love to be remembered for many projects. Time to come. I have opportunity of standing close side by side with the Vice President of the Apostolic Church and Lona Territorial Chairman. Thank you so much for, your you opportunity, for the opportunity you. given Thank to me. You. I'm very grateful. Thank you for inviting me. Thank you. God bless you. God bless Nigeria. Thank, Thank you, so you very much. much.